got a another kind of on brand sci fi if you like sci fi and space everything much like I do NASA their crews tackling space issues right here on Earth. Yeah, they certainly are and as they prepare for a pretty historic flight here they are also fighting to help save young lives. ABC's Elwin Lopez has more. These four men and women are on a mission to make history to reach the highest Earth orbit ever flown. Where we're starting and where we're hoping to end could be what ultimately opens up human spaceflight for, for everyone with a brand new launch vehicle that can take human beings back to the moon, to Mars. The all civilian Polaris Dawn crew will also take a shot at the first ever commercial spacewalk. Simply getting all those things right and making them successful opens up a lot of other opportunities. But while in space, much of their focus will be here on Earth. The astronauts partnering with St. Jude Children's Hospital to raise millions, all in an effort to eradicate childhood cancer globally. We'll be doing a tremendous amount of research in the five days we're in space, as well as continuing to raise funds for St. Jude and helping to combat childhood cancer here on Earth right now. And this isn't the first time. Their last SpaceX mission raised $250 million. This time they say they're aiming higher, both on and out of this planet. Those funds will go toward finding cures for kids with cancer and to better detect the disease around the world. Sadly, survival rates around the globe, especially in low and low and middle income countries, survival rates are like 20% or less. Still on the ground, the crew getting a face to face with those they're on a mission to help. And then we're going to slingshot out really high. And inspiring them to go where many have never before. Dream and dream bigger because you, everything's possible. And we prove it here on, on the campus of St. Jude. And this crew will be testing in-space communications for future missions to Mars, the moon, and beyond. But they have some time to gear up for this. They aren't expected to launch into space until next year. Elwin Lopez, ABC News, Atlanta.